Hello, ghosties. We're back with some more Octopath Traveler. No break today. We are going to continue on. We are going to kick off the new character story, so let us begin. Let's see what we can make happen. Albrecht. Those brigands. What villains would take a defenseless child as a hostage? Hold fast. Philip, I'm coming for you. Gotta go save little Phil. His name is Ulberic, and he is a warrior. Here in Cobblestone, a remote village in the Highlands, he hires out his sword under the assumed name of Berg. Once a great knight, he lost both land and liege, as well as his reason for wielding a sword. Yet one fateful day, bandits raid the village he now calls home, stealing off with his protege, the young Philip. Ulberic takes sword in hand and sets off after the brigands. He will need worthy allies on the path he has chosen. Eight years ago. Hells! Is he man or beast? Man or oh, beast. voiceover. Great! Well, look how you're fighting him. God have mercy. Ulbrich Eisenberg! You know my name, and so to business, who will be the next to die? Yep, that's definitely a Dave character. <laughs> it's you who'll be dying! Look about you! We have the numbers! Enemy reinforcements! On the left flag! To Sir Ulbrich's side, men! The blackguards have had their way for long enough! Uh, it matters not. We're done here. Sound the retreat. Withdraw to the rallying point. Sir Ulbrich, I Sir feel Ulbrich. we would. Oh, I still voiced. Great. Too late. Nothing I couldn't handle. Can you hold this position? You make for His Majesty's camp, sir? Just so. Our foe attacked from both flanks. We have no orders from the crowd. This concerns me. His Majesty is well guarded, sir. Sir Earhart is with you. I know this. There is no stronger knight in the realm, other than yourself, of course, my lord. With Sir Earhart at his side, Surely his majesty is in no danger. Perhaps not, but we must be certain. If he's a bad guy... I would know how the battle unfolds. Besides, word from the king always lifts the men's spirits. As you wish, sir. We will hold this ground. Be safe, and may the gods guide your blade. And yours, Sir Ulbrich. His Majesty's own guard, slain to the last man. Who could have done such a thing? Erhart, where is Erhart? So, it was you. Yep, called it. The stories are fairly in line. Done. 
Have you not eyes? The king is dead by my hand. What madness? What treachery is this? No madness here. We call it treachery, if you will. I thought you were a friend. A brother! Brothers indeed. How many times did we cross swords like this in the practice yards? And how many times have I told you? I see your every move, your every strike before it falls. As I see yours. Ah, but you've not seen everything. I saved one trick for the day I knew would come. Always the same dream. Ah, Philip. What is it? Cryvan! How did you know it was me, sir? One must always be on his guard, even when he rests. Yes, a knight... <sighs> no, I am no knight. Just a man with a sword, and nothing more. If you say so, sir. But there's lots of men who carry swords that can't do half of what you do. Probably not. I think I think they've they've probably drummed out most of what they can do for JRPG storylines. Oh, I almost forgot, sir. The headman's looking for you. Says he wants a word. He didn't say about what. Tell him I'm on my way. Yes, sir. I'll go on ahead and let him know, sir. He'll be in the square. You know the one. It's kind of weird seeing eight fairly cliche stories all in one game. <laughs> my liege lost. My land in ruin. I wandered aimlessly. After a time, I came to this village. Here, I earn my keep as a hired sword, hiding behind another man's name. Just waiting for the stream to fix itself. There we go. I'm not really sure why it's having such a struggle today. Make a quick little adjustment. There we go. Defending the villagers from bandit raids, teaching young men how to handle a blade. Not a glamorous life, but it puts food on my plate. A man like me knows only the battlefield. Worth only as much as the blade at my side and the arm that swings it. Yeah, thanks, Zudud. Thank you so much for that. <laughs> when that blade fails to save my sworn liege, British and everything. What does that make me? For years, I've asked myself that question. One thing I do know is that I owe this village a debt, a debt I intend to repay. But that's enough brooding for one morning. The headman's waiting. Uh, Berg, sir. How there? 
Down patrol, sir. Nothing to report. I see. Good to hear it. Hmm? Two of you today. Usually only one man does the rounds. Yes. Aye, sir. Edmund thought it best to be, but I got into the hills of late. There we go. That's that's a poor merchant gutted his coin purse just yesterday. What a grisly sight, sir. Indeed. Indeed. These are dangerous times. One can never be too careful. Careful. <laughs> I hear Headman is looking for me. Headman. Just that's so. nice and creative. As he mentioned, this, that sir, he should still be over in the square. Now, if you'll excuse us, sir, morning patrol, resume rounds. All the accents. Oh, we're just gonna butcher everything we can. Hello, headmaster. Headman, whatever you are. I like his hat. Oi, Berg, there you are. <laughs> Good morning to you, sir. I see. Morning to you both. Philip said you wanted to speak to me. Ah. Yes, yes, I'll get straight to the point. We've had reports of bandits in the hills. I see. I see you've doubled the patrols. Oh, I yes, I was hoping to ask for your aid. With bandits lurking, the village just daren't enter the hills. We cannot check the traps. Car like forward. <sighs> it's quite the predicament, to say the least. Mm. Leave it to me. Where can I find these thieves? I As for the precise location of the den, I fear I cannot say. I spent sent some of the men out searching, but Bird, sir. in the meantime, could you pick up the militia and their drills? Oh. Our men are keen, but they don't know a pommel from a pike, if you get my meaning. As you wish. Consider it done. Beg pardon? Ah, oh, sir! If it would not burden, might my Philip join the trading? <laughs> if he's willing, so am I. <laughs> oh, he's more than willing, sir. I assure you, he's been pestering me for weeks to ask you. <laughs> That's a brave lad. The boy has pluck and ambition, and he could find a worse man to look up to than Berg here. Aww. Ever since my husband died in the war, you know? Hmm. It's just the boy's getting to that age when he needs a father. <laughs> That's a bit of pressure to throw on a man. Oh, no, 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 I didn't mean to sit. Your boy is already a credit to the village. It would be my honor to train him. How can I ever repay you? You are too kind, sir. <laughs> well, let's settle then. I train the lad well and see what his mother is proud. I see. I will. Oh, not more voices, please. Oh, thank God. Okay. Utilize each character. All right. Ulbrich can challenge townspeople to a duel. Yo, let's battle, fool. A battle fair and square to arms. Always ready to spa, sir. Let us fight with honor. Victory shall be mine. Toast. I grow strong. Ugh, got me again. <laughs> you attack with boldness, but you leave yourself open. And so a simple counterblow quickly strikes you down. You must remember balance in all things. I see. Balance, right. I'll try to remember that, sir. Who else do I gotta go beat on? You wanna go, nerd? Uh, but, sir, I hope you sir. can spar with us and teach us some tricks. Whoop! Toast. 
two arms. It's always an honor to train with you, warrior of your skill, sir. Apparently, that's how he does it. Level two. Just like that. <laughs> it's no good, sir. We're no match for the likes of you. You are too hesitant. It is important to protect yourself. This is true. But you will never win a fight if you lack the courage to strike. If you say so, sir. Your turn, Philip. <laughs> oh, I guess not. That said, if you two fought, if you fought side by side, you might complement each other rather well. Indeed. I was just thinking that myself, sir. Just so. Better than the sum of our parts, eh, sir? <laughs> what do you say, friend? Fight side by side? <laughs> two heads up, better than one, huh? What's this? Something the matter, sir? What? No, sorry. It's a fine idea. Train together and you'll be capable soldiers one day. Yes. Sir! I thank you. The two of us will go on patrol then. By your leave. I see. Yes. Good. If you would. <laughs> Sir! Me next, please! He's got a British... I can't do a British accent. No. You are not ready yet. You'll need to work on your form. Hey, come on! Aww! Mm. The drills, as I showed you, and you'll be sparring soon enough. You have talent, lad. I do? I see. Not many boys your age take to the sword so quickly, and you've trained my share. And I've trained my share. <laughs> Crivens, thank you, sir! My father, he, he's, you know, gone, sir. Died in the war. So I've heard. Will you be my dad? Mother's looked for me ever since, all on her own. But soon, soon I'll be a man grown, and it'll be my turn to take care of her. <laughs> she's a lucky woman to have you have a son so brave. Hey, thanks. So you see why I've got to get stronger, sir? I have to protect mother and everyone in the village. After all she's done for me, I owe her that much. I too once had someone to protect. Sir? It's nothing, lad. Just old memories. Keep at your training and you'll be a strong man before long. You got it. Bye, sir. Boom. Map. I should make a round of the village. Go beat up more people. Why, hi. Feeling thirsty? This here's tavern's best meat in the Highlands, they say. Or I could just walk up the stairs, apparently. Brigands, we're under attack. <laughs> Yo, it's totally uh. Robin from Stardew Valley. It's Robin from Stardew Valley. I found her. Work, sir. Bring it to the hills. I'm on it. Ah. Ah, these dirty peasants don't know their place. We outnumber them. Surround them. Stick a blade in their backs so and the boss finds out a sweater slowed us down! That's, uh... Do your worst, you brutes. That's right. You'll not be getting past us! Damn it! Damn it, all these swanards know how to fight! Look. Sir! I swear Good work, I... man. You did well to hold them off. But I'll take over from here. Who the hells are you supposed to be? 
It's a bleeding fool if he thinks he can take us all. Oh. He's got a fancy blade, eh? I know your sort, Hedge Knight. I've cut down my share of your betters. The hell? I'm telling ye, this one's trouble. Indeed. You both have the right of it, but I'm a common Hedge Knight with no name to speak of. How about you? But if you come looking for trouble, you've found it. <laughs> Stoner, I'll cut out your tongue. Aye. Enough prattle, let's skewer him. Will not fail. Victory shall be mine. <laughs> the battle is truly joined. I will cut you down. <laughs> the battle is truly out of my way. Get wrecked! With each battle, I grow stronger. You! You can handle the blade eye, but this is the end of it. That's right. And the boss here's about this year, dead men, you hear? We'll see about that, won't we? Oh, my boy! Hey, come on! Let me go, you ugly! They took him from me. My poor Philip, he was trying to protect me, but those those animals! Damn it all. <sighs> Forgive me, sir. There are so many of them, and... Oh, doesn't right. matter now. We have to save the lad. We know where they are now. Hold up in a cave deep in the mountains. Indeed. Then let's go. God only knows what they'll do to him. Wait! What? Sir, we have to do something. They might kill the boy. No. If you leave now, who will protect the village when the thieves return? No, you would be playing right into their hands. Uh -oh. God's a mercy. Is there nothing we can do, sir? I, I will see. go. <laughs> Alone, but sir, even you. Mm. You stay and guard the village, at least until you're sure they're not coming back. <gasps> Chief. I am... Forgive me. You are the boy, our only hope. Can you do this, Berg? As you wish. Consider it done. Oh, Please, sir, bring him back safe. I swear on my blade. You have my word. Right after I ask these random strangers if they'll help me. And so, I must go save the boy from those ruffians. What's that you say? You wish to lend me your aid? Hmm, you seem like you could hold your own on the battlefield. It would be my honor to call you a comrade. Philip has been taken to the brigands' den north of the village. We must make haste. All right, so we can't afford a new sword for him. Does he only use sword? I didn't notice if he used something else. Alright, so he also used his spear. Let's buy him a, sh a spear. Uh, we can buy him a round shield too, I believe. A nice cheap way to get him a little bit more defense early on. Uh, 
All right, and now we are off. Uh, Berg, sir. The brigands are holed up in yonder cave. I'm sure the most dangerous, sir. Best repair. Well of four setting out. Shut up, nerd. Don't tutorialize me. Gotta go up. Can't we settle this like gentlemen? An interesting dilemma. Get broke. Now, what next? Oh, ice here to prove. Good. Thus ends your lesson. Double level up for old brick. Boom. Alright, so Cyrus will go up a level next battle so we can just pump out as much big damage. Wonderful. Alright, so... He just hits like a truck. Cyrus is a magic truck. There are so many just free items in this one little area. Now we're gonna steal from the bird. Out of my way. What's yours? Really? We had a 1% chance of missing and we missed. Not be defeated. That's disappointing. I'll make 
make this quick. Out of my way. Is truly joined. I will cut you down. One down. My turn. What's yours? Give me that grape. Wrecked. All right. Time to teach rats. Yeah, the party comp's not bad. I do think I prefer my Beast Hunter over the Warrior, but we'll see what skills he continues to get. Yeah, the party comp itself is quite good. <laughs> Look who's come. Have you lost something, Hedge Knight? Mm. Move aside before I cut you in two. <laughs> you have courage. I'll give you that. Just who are you anyway? Never seen no Hedge Knight swing a blade the way you do. Indeed. And you'll step aside if you know what's good for you. You're in our land now, Hedge Knight. We give the orders here. <laughs> you have skill, but you're a man like any other, and you'll bleed as red. Get him! I will not fail. Hmm. Ah, a tempest of Strong lad, I'm coming for you. Cyrus is like, I give no shits, just get out of my way. Become more readily targeted by foes, so basically a taunt. Increase the use of physical defense. Attack random foes of the polar arm five to ten times. I kind of like the taunt. I'm going to grab cross strike, though. I 
I will get that chest. I'll make this quick. Out of my way. Get iced. I'll do my best. We have a lot of nice AoE now, so we're able to. Do a much better job at just like spreading the damage across the enemies. Not bad. A passing. Cyrus is almost broken powerful. <laughs> He's just he just annihilates full enemy <laughs> parties. Like <laughs> An ungodly power. Oh, went the wrong way. So there is an auto save. You can see it down there. It is auto saving something. I just don't know if you can get to the auto save. Empty coin pouch. Nice. Not bad. A passing. Copper lantern. I wonder who that's for. It's a good day for back. Who gets the dark AoE? I kind of want that. I would say we're rocking it. This party, the party is pretty good. I'm, a, I'm a fan. Is there just like a cells slot? Apparently we had a whole bunch of stuff that could just be sold.
What up, Waltz? How are you? First letters, you can spell the entire game with an octo, um, octopath. The equipped character will absorb single target damage for allies who are near death. That's kind of cool. There is no choice. My turn. I'm not sure. We'll find out. That's got a lot of health. That rat had a lot of health. about this friend of yours. Does he know knows how to fight, does he? That's right. He's stronger than any of you put together. You won't stand a chance. <laughs> hey, come on! Oh joke, stop laughing. <laughs> yeah, that Let makes his hedge knight the strongest blade in the realm. <laughs> if he thinks he can beat all of us, he's more madman than knight. The same fairy tale boy real knights don't piddle away their days in company of swine herds. <laughs> He's a knight from the stories. A damsel in distress might serve a better rate. Reckon we should go back for the mum. <laughs> I drink to that! Hey, come on! Stop it! You'll be laughing when Sir Berg is through with you. <laughs> Sir Berg? Now there's a frightening name. Look, me arms all trembling. Shut up, all of you. Boss? Aye. Reckon the boys got more courage than a lot of you, and more wits to boot. The less yammering and more sharp than your stabbers. <clears throat> but, but boss, ain't no way the hedge knight will follow us here, unless he's mad and all. That's right. Aye, it ain't like it's his own son or nothing. Why should he care? <laughs> Why indeed. Things would go interesting, though, if he does show. Always had a soft spot for men with more courage than sense. Like the boy here. What do you say, laddie? Care to join our little family? We're always looking for men with pluck. Not on your life. I'll never join you. I'm a brave warrior like Sir Berg. <laughs> you hear that man? The boy says he's too good for banditry. Think you're the only one who feels that way, boy? Let me tell you something. Hmm? What is it, boss? Sir! Sorry I'm late, lad. Got held up along the way. Hi, look. 
It's the mighty Sir Berg in the flesh. He is mad. Now do you get in here anyway? We're at the lookouts. Dead. Bleeding in the dirt, last I saw. That's a little cold. <laughs> Sir! Stay back! Did, did, did he just... He parried the boss's blow! Hang me, but I ain't never seen no one do that before. <laughs> You're quick, all right. And strong. Clearly, no common hedge knight, are you? Just as you are no common brigand. Played. Like it, do you? It just so happens to be a present. Heart. Oh, you know the man, do you now? So it is his blade. As if I needed another reason to cut you down where you stand. How do you know Earhart, rogue? Speak, or I'll slice your throat. A little moody. Ah, you've got a score to say. Is that it? I can see it in your eyes. They blaze like fire when you said his name. Look, I don't know what passed between you and Earhart. But if you're looking to ask questions of me, my good sir, you'll have to earn the right! I will not fail. Damn, he's a big boy. All right. <laughs> Alright, so he's uh, afflicted by lightning. I will cut you down. Ah. All Smite them down. Well then. Yeah, you did. Victory shall be mine. Now, what next? All night, smite them down. I'll not be defeated. I see. Victory shall be mine. Out of my way. Boom. I'll do my best. May the sacred flame shine forth. <laughs> He just shoots him and runs away. How about you?
do my bidding, townsperson. Ah, shot him too. Oof. Lightning bolt. Out of my way. Here. No. They're all poison now, so they're going to start taking good damage from that. We can have... I'll do my best. Yeah, she can only carry one at a time right now. So that breaks all of them. Well then. The Let's get big hits out. Cyrus is going to come in. Oh, they're dead. <laughs> Cyrus is because I choose you is right. Lightning and all. Oh man. Let your wounds be healed. Out of my way. What's yours? No, thing. Oh, I will cut you down. Not what I meant to do, but it works. So we're going to be able to break him really quick now. We already stole. So we already stole an item from him. We got a bunch of grapes. like great weapons to steal or not and maybe maybe after the tutorial and you have everybody in your party um the bosses could start letting you steal better things but each enemy only seems to hold one item we're stealing as well so Yeah, stealing from people is pretty effective. But stealing during combat doesn't hasn't turned out to be really all that valuable. Boom.
I yield. Mm. Now I will have my answers. Do you know, Erdhart? Aye. We fought alongside each other is all. Served together in a band of mercenaries. He was already an old hand when I signed up. Helped me out when I sh and showed me the ropes. Cell mm -hmm. sword. And where is he now? <laughs> Damned if I know. When our group disbanded, he went our separate. We went our separate ways. After that, I drifted from town to town to the next. Tried one trade, then another, but swinging a blade's the only thing that's ever come natural to me. So here I am. Times are lean, and a man's got to make a living. Anyone could use a sword arm like yours. You could protect people instead of stealing from them. Aye. Aye. I could, but honest work takes more wits than the gods saw fit to bless me with. Never meant to do no harm, but life doesn't always give us a choice in the matter, does it? Choice or no, you must answer for your crimes. Aye. Aye. I know the score, but I've got my men to think about, too. But boss, wait, well, wait now. What, what are you saying, boss? Oy. Easy now, man. The hedge knight has the right of it. I've got more than enough blood in mommy hands. Live by the sword and... Well, you know how it goes. A man has to own what he's done. No. Enough blood's been spilled here today. Surrender and I will see that you get your... You and your men are not harmed. You do me a kindness at night, and so I'll do you one in return. I told you I didn't know where Aaron Hart is, and I don't. But I know someone who might. Hi. <sighs> Gustav's his name. Sir Gustav. Some call him the Black Knight, or other such fussed up nonsense. Erdos taught us both how to use the sword back in the mercenary bend. You should find him in Victor's Hollow. And this man will tell me where Ironheart is? Aye. He might. Then again, he might not. Still, if you want to find him that much, I reckon it's worth trying. I can see I saw your eyes, eyes, Hedge Knight. They were dead, like a fish. But the moment you saw my blade, they came to life. <laughs> dead. Have I truly been... <laughs> eh. What does a common thief know of men's souls? Bug, thank the gods you're safe. The villagers are well as well, sir. That's right. Round up the thieves and lock them in the village, gal. Mm -hmm. Bug, I could have swear that I have gods be good, Eisenberg. <laughs> Should have known the way your eyes lit up at the mention of Earnhardt's name. Aye, uh, you're no hedge knight. You're Sir Olabrick Eisenberg, the unbending blade. The unbending blade? Damn it! They said he was slain when Hornberg fell. But, but, I'd heard he lived, but scarce believed it until today. You might get more replay value out of Darkest Dungeon for the Switch. That would be my only thing. I don't know how much there is to replay in this until I've actually completed it. And I don't know what the end game is going to be like or if there's another level of depth to it other than just going through the stories. Is it true, sir? Are you a real knight? No. Long ago, lad. Long ago. Let's be on our way. We've kept your mother waiting long enough. You got yes, sir! Some time later. This village has been good to me, but it's time to move on. I shall find Ehrenhart, so I might find the reason I wield this blade. To find a man named Gustav, and God's willing, Ehrenhart himself. So he's on an adventure to seek the man that betrayed him. Victor's Hollow, the man said, that's where I must go. I had stopped believing that I would one day don these clothes again. 
The journey will be long one, and I have no more reason to tarry. the wrong exit. So you truly mean, you truly no. mean to leave us? You have shown me nothing but kindness. I am forever in your debt. Oh, it is we who owe you, friend. Were the choice mine to make, you would stay with us forever. But it is your life to live. We won't ever forget all you've done for us, sir. The next time any dirty brigands come after us, we'll give them a good kick in in your name. We're no knights, sir, but you've taught us well. We can protect our home, at the very least. Glad to hear it. I'm sorry, sir. Philip, he wouldn't come. He didn't want you to see him crying, most like. I understand. Tell the boy I am counting on him to grow strong and to look after his dear mother. Thank you, sir. I will. When you've done whatever it is you must do, pray come back and visit us. No matter how far your journey takes you, you'll always have a home here. Thank you. And with that, I had best... Good blow, lad. Just smacked Sorry. by a kid. I'm going to keep training while you're away. Then, when you come back, I'll be even stronger. And then, then, maybe I could. I, lad. I'll get stronger too. And we'll see each other again. Have my word. You, you better not forget. The night, the night always keeps his word. Except for the night that betrayed me, but you know that's that's just. And thus, Ulbrich, the knight, set out on a new journey. He would find his former comrade Ironheart and ask why he did what he did, and mayhap he would discover that which he had lost. The reason why he wields his blade, what fate awaits him, only time can answer that. So he's probably the long lost king to Hornburg, would be my guess, for his end game. We'll see what happens there. Boom. All right, but I'm gonna go eat some food because I am starving and I, I need I need to make me a taco because tacos are delicious. So I'm gonna take a I'm gonna take a break. I don't know if I will be back later on or not. That will all come down to what I am doing today, but we will see. So it is lunchtime. That is right, wife. It is lunchtime. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying Octopath as much as I am. We will be back on Monday tomorrow with Duelist tomorrow evening. And then most of the week we will probably be streaming. Um, thanks, Waltz. <laughs> we, we will be most likely streaming Octopath. Maybe a day of Darkest Dungeon, but I'm not sure yet. Just, just having a good time with Octopath. So thank you all very much. And if I don't see you again today... As always, till the next video and or stream.
Thank you very much for watching, Ghosties. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to give it a like, give it a share, and come back very soon for some more great content here on the channel. No idea what we will be playing next, but I hope it is just as exciting as it was today. Feel free to come check me out over on Twitch at Fino Games. Thank you all very much for your continued support, and as always, till the next video.